Welcome in guys. It's been a while since I've been around, but I'm going to try a new game today. 
Um, it's not new, it's just new to me. I've never heard of it. It just happened to come packaged with another game I wanted to play. Um, so today I'm going to be trying out The Search. And I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. I don't know what I'm searching for, or if there's someone I'm searching for, or we'll find out together. So we're going to go ahead and click new game and get started. I should probably be working, like, you know, grading papers or something, but this is more fun. It's nothing more vast than the blank canvas. It is a place before the birth of an idea pulled out from infinity. It is within the canvas that a search takes place. Oh, okay. For direction. So search for direction. For meaning. For identity. Oh, I'm searching for a lot. No, you didn't tell me that. When was the last time you looked into infinity? That's cool, Zeno. Okay, I have to use my cursor and hover and click on areas to navigate around the world. Oh, am I playing a point and click? Oh no, <laughs> great, point and clicks. Okay, I don't know, we'll see what happens here. Click on the menu button to save your progress, load another save, blah, 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 okay. What is this strange place? I don't remember how I got here. Some parts of this world are without color, and some parts are visible. But the rest of it is like a void. Okay, pages will be added. Okay, so, oh. Okay, yes, point and click. It's point and click. All right, I can almost detect there's more here. I can't see it, but I can feel it. Almost like I don't have the capacity to see just yet. This is the first time I'm actually streaming a game on my computer instead of on the Xbox. So it's a little bit weird for me. Follow the clues I've left for you. Follow the clues I've oh, she's left gonna read for to you. me. Okay. They will lead to the key that will take you out of the wasteland. I speak through words as well as symbols. Through words, you will understand with your mind. Through symbols, you understand with your heart. The invisible. <laughs> um, I'd like to point out that words are symbols, but okay. All right. Follow the clue. Point and click. I gotta remember. Okay, I'm gonna follow the clues. Oh, uh, so far so good. I have a lot of students this year, <laughs> but I get to teach the honors kids this year, so that's kind of cool. I still see Adriel every day. He stops by and says hi. Use this button to access your inventory. Okay. Okay, well, I don't know if I need that right now, so. I think this is the first legitimate point and click game I've ever played. The only other point and click game I tried to play, I played it in first person, like 3D movement and everything. A camera. Okay, I've got a camera now. How's your school year going so far? Listen. A ticket with the word listen. Oh, can I put it in? I can. Nice. Do I want to use clues? I don't know. I don't know how hard this game is. I didn't have a difficulty like setting or anything. So, um, oh, that's tough. Okay, we'll use clues. 
Oh, I can turn them on and off later. Okay. So. I'm in a different world now. In this one, I can see everything. It feels different. The colors are. Oops. Well, uh, the colors are vivid. All right. <clears throat> I don't think I've ever, this, this has to be the first point and click game I've ever really played. Maybe not, but it feels like it is. Oops. I accidentally sent my mouse out the wrong way. 37, nothing here. Yeah, I heard something. What's that bell? There might be something of interest. Okay, that... All right, I think I might turn those off. Because I'll see if I need them later. But for now, I'm going to turn them off because that was like a clue before I even felt like I needed a clue. I was still just looking around. I guess it didn't like me not doing what it wanted me to do. Let's go over here. You can see here, a birdcage. Okay, so I see my camera, I see a camera. So maybe I put the camera in the birdcage? I do. Okay. Listen to the voice within, the doors will open. The invisible. Birds symbolize the soul across many belief systems. Carl Jung once said, What use now is his lofty perch and his wide horizon, when his own dear soul is languishing in prison? Lately, this is how I've been feeling. Trapped. Listen to the voice within. Doors will open.
when there are influences that keep you from hearing your true voice, that is the wasteland. There is a reference in these notes to the way it was a place where people believed in things they did not really believe and did things that were against their true nature. The process of making paint in this world seems to symbolize how ideas become reality. Ideas, or concepts, are captured through the camera, like how the mind captures ideas, and then is represented as a symbol on the picture card. Then the lighter is used to refine the idea, similar to how an idea must be transformed from its purely conceptual state into something that exists in the real world.
After painting on that canvas, the painting became real. Oh. It became part of the world I could step into. Painting in that passageway reminds me of an essay I once read about creating a new reality. This mic is sensitive to the touch. I think moment, I bumped it. <laughs> we can choose to be passive receivers of reality or choose For like to create three a minutes reality of our own. Or so. It's been a while. Okay. So now, um, that looks like a screwdriver. Can I have the screwdriver? I want the screwdriver. Can I have the screwdriver? I figured there would be a ticket somewhere. Let's see. Aha! A ticket! This game is kind of weird, and, and like I said, it's turning into hidden objects game. When was the last time you remained silent and still enough to hear the voice within? It will guide you to the key. I keep I have no idea when my sound went out. The voice within. If I were to draw from my studies reading Carl Jung, I would... Jung argued that the unconscious had a profound influence on the lives Oops, well, whatever. Let's see. Those who ignored their unconscious ran into frustrations and suffering. Woohoo. Alright. I want to go down there. Let's go to the ticket booth and on to wherever I'm going. <sighs> A ticket with the word empty. Yeah, I hear you. Check everywhere. Okay, yeah, sure. Okay, I'll check everywhere. Yes, clue. Okay, here's some canvas. Sometimes detours are necessary to move forward. Detours. Lately, my life feels like it's been going down the wrong path. It's difficult finding satisfaction with the art I'm making, and the workload is quite grueling, too. It feels like I'm stuck on a treadmill that keeps going faster and faster, and it becomes harder to keep up. What if all this busyness is just a trap, distracting me from pursuing something better? <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know my character's name. Here's a mirror. I have a paintbrush. Okay. Anything else? Here's the word empty. Okay. Can I go now? I can. Great.
Okay, so here's the canvas. So let's just go ahead and... Oh, it doesn't fit there. Okay. Like go downstairs. Okay. Right. I wanna go back. Go back. Oh, that's the same. Okay. Each world yields to the power of its own color. The power of its own color. That indicates what I've started to notice. Each world seems to have its own color theme in the items I pick up, and each world uses a different color of paint. Blue was the primary color. Yeah, okay. Oh, camera. I gotta take a camera picture. I gotta take a picture of this. And then I got to set fire to the picture. And then I'm going to put the paint in, mix the paint. And then now I have to find another canvas. I assume. That's what I had to do in the last one. In the first one. Find canvas, the paint, the paintbrush. I don't think I can do that because that's green paint. Okay. Oh goodness. This game is something. I think oh, there's the paintbrush. I found it. So it told me where it was. <laughs> well, it wouldn't let me grab those tools, so I guess I can't do anything with that door. Alright, now can I go paint the crowbar? Because I want to get the crowbar so I can open the door. I bet you that's what I got to do. I'm going to paint the crowbar. So I'm going to take my green paintbrush. <coughs> combine it with my green paint. And then I'm going to take the green paintbrush and paint this. Yes. And then I get a crowbar. And then I'm going to go downstairs again. Over here to this door and crowbar the door. Yeah, aha, canvas. We've got it. This one doesn't require me to take notes, so that's good. <laughs> Yet. A tree is blocking the doorway. Find a way to get through. Okay. Well, let's... Let's paint a way in. I feel like I'm Harold with this purple crayon. Nice. 
days. Now this is pretty neat. I don't really know what's going on. But a card with a picture of a floor path. Okay. Let's set fire to it. I gotta set fire to the picture. Do I still have the rebirth ticket? No, I don't think so. Okay, let's look around. Do I see any paint pots? Oh look, the rebirth ticket. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the rebirth room. found a frame. I got it. I found it. Oh, I didn't find the paint yet. Okay. I gotta go find the paint first. So I can put the canvas up. <clears throat> What's that? Paint. Ladder. Looking for the paint pot. Are you going to tell me where the paint pot is? Listen to the beat of your own drum. Every artist has their own cadence. Follow it. Every artist has their own cadence. <laughs> Pretty much all of my creative efforts have been dictated by someone else. To have my own cadence... Where would I even start? I think tomorrow I'm going to play Mortuary I'm Assistant so again. I'm working with other people's ideas. Like that game. That I have a hard time coming up with my own. Like I just can't see them. Really, I'm not sure I can fix your problems. What's over here? Sometimes detours are not. Oh, that. Lately, my life feels. It feels like I'm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Can I take a picture of that? No, that's not how I take No? I have a rebirth ticket again. I have an empty ticket. Do I need to go back to the empty room? It's on near the ladder. There was a paintbrush near the ladder. The canvas was on the table. I wonder where the paint pot is. Uh, uh, do you want me to go back to the uh, empty? I can go back to empty. I have a ticket for empty. Okay. It literally told me on the wall where everything was. Let's see if we can find a scrap of paper. Just a small scrap of paper. Each world. That note Not indicates that what I've started to note it. Outside.
This game is weird. <laughs> I'm glad it was only four dollars. Well, I am outside. Take a picture of that, right? Mm -hmm. I hope I find this pot of paint, this paint pot soon because it's getting late. <laughs> I gotta put my kiddo to bed. What big rocks? These big rocks? No, they don't. They don't look interesting at all. They're so uninteresting, you won't even let me look at them. This big rocks. Ha, ah, those big rocks. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> All right, so let's mix our paint and dip our paintbrush. And let's go back up the stairs. All in all, I don't know what I think of this game. We'll see. I'll probably start continue it anyway, but I'm not sure um, how much I'm going to get out of this. All right, let's go ahead and paint this one and then I'm gonna save and call it a night before I go here. So I am gonna save it because no auto save apparently. It is getting a little bit late for a school night, but I'll try and be back on tomorrow. Maybe I'll play Mortuary Assistant instead. Uh, that game is really fun. Or I can play Discolored and see if I like that one. But until then, I hope you stay safe. And I'll see you later. Bye.